them, people don't always make sense. How come? Because bad things happen to everyone. And it's hard to keep being yourself after they do. What do you think? Should we have left her behind? I don't know if we did the right thing. How can you tell? Well, it's not like math, Clem. Sometimes there just isn't the right answer. I hate math. <laughs> Me too, sweet pea. Part of growing up is doing what's best for the people you care about. Even if sometimes, that means hurting someone else. I don't want to hurt anyone. It's not that easy. I'm scared, Lee. What can I tell you to make it better? That it'll be okay. It will. It's gonna get better, Clem. You'll make it better. Everything's gonna be all right. <laughs> now let's try to get some sleep. out from the shock where are we been driving a few hours now we had to run the truck to keep you warm how do you feel it hurts couldn't find the bullet it must have gone clean through it'll burn a while but you'll be fine those sons of bitches i mean i expected it from the russian but mike i could tell they were working on something i didn't think they'd go that far yeah well who would steal our food and shoot a kid should have thrown in with trash like that in the first place. I can't believe they did that. I don't think they knew what they were doing, except trying to get away. Yeah, well, they're gone now. Good fucking riddance. Now that Clem's awake, we should talk about where we're going. We're headed north. What, to find Wellington? You sure talk a lot of shit, but you got a better plan? We head south, back to Howes. Carver's camp? What the fuck kind of plan is that? Wellington's out there. We have to keep looking, Jane. Clem, you can't be falling for this. She made up her mind, Jane. Clem, please. This is suicide. Why don't you let her think for herself for once? Why don't you? Me? Look, even if there is some place up here, it could take us weeks to find it. We could get back to Howe's in a day. Tell you what, we can turn around just as soon as you pry this wheel from a cold, dead fingers. How's that sound? Whatever. I give up. Get your feet off the dash. Let's play a game, Clem. I spy, with my little eye, an asshole. Your turn. Grow up. Go to hell. I'll pull this fucking car over. Go ahead. You wanna die out here? You're both being children. Me? I couldn't see the damn road. Bet you're having trouble seeing a lot of things these days. You shut your fucking mouth. I am done playing games with you, Jay. Fuck you. You don't know a damn thing about me. Oh, I know exactly what you are. Nothing. Nobody cares about you, and you don't care about nobody but yourself. That makes you nothing. What is it with you? It's your family, right? Don't. It is, isn't it? 
I'm warning you, you little shit. You're just another type A asshole trying to save a bunch of dead people. Shut up, both of you. Stay out of this, Clem. Don't tell her what to do. You listen to me. You mouth off about my family, and I will fucking end you. Jesus Christ, I'm so sick of this wounded warrior crap. Just pull over. I can't take this. What? Running away again? What a fucking shocker. In the end, still only care about yourself, right? And where were you when Sarita got bit, Kenny? Huh? Where were you? I was there. I couldn't... God damn you, I love that woman! This is crazy. Ha! Uh -huh. Someone here is crazy, but it ain't me. You know the thing about people like you, Kenny? You're just a bomb waiting to go off. Everyone talks about you behind your back because they're afraid of you. That ain't true. Mike? Bonnie? Sarita? Fucking liar, that ain't true! Everyone around you knows that sooner or later, they're gonna end up dead. Sarita knew it, I know it, and so does Clementine. I told you not to talk about my family! Fuck you! You fucking piece of shit! Go to hell, you son of a bitch! Jesus! <laughs> Okay? I'm fine. How's AJ? He's fine. You sure? Yes. Clem, you all right? Yeah. Kenny, I'm... Wait, hold on. Go around. One of them might have diesel. We shouldn't stop here. We're running on fumes. Got no choice. When I holler, it's okay. Drive up closer. Anything happens, I'll try to meet you there. All right? Kenny... Asshole. God! I can't do this anymore. I'm serious, Clem. You're both losing it. Clem, everyone's like that around him. You know that. Clem, we could leave. Right now. Are you serious? What about AJ? Look, I, I know you're close to him, but Kenny would never let him go. This is our chance, Clem. Don't you ever want to know what it's like to live your own life? It's snowing. Why are they moving? They must not be cold enough yet. Fuck! Get us out of here! I don't know how to drive! See that pedal on the floor? Step on it! Don't just sit there!
Jane? Kenny! You all right? Yeah. Where is he? Where's the kid? He's with her. You left him with her? Jane? Jane! Wait. Oh, thank Christ. Jane, you okay? Where's the kid? Jane, where is he? Where is he? He's... What are you saying? No. No! No, not again. Not again. Clem, look at me. No matter what happens, just stay out of it. Okay? Just trust me, Clem. Stay out of what? You have to trust me. You're gonna see what he really is. Go! 
I'm right behind you. Let me see him. I thought... I thought we lost you, buddy. I won't let you out of my sights again. Then you... You didn't have to kill her. You didn't have to kill Jane. It was me or her, Clem. She was trying to kill me, too. If she hadn't lied about Alvin here, it wouldn't have went that far. I just... Why would she? She was nuts, Clem. A disturbed person that had her own agenda and was looking out for herself. Shh, shh, shh. It's all right, buddy. Hey, listen. I didn't want that to happen either. I thought she'd killed Alvy, Clem. And at any point, she could have stopped what was happening by saying he was fine. She wanted a fight. I never, ever hurt you. You understand? I was protecting you. You believe me, right? Just imagine what she did to Elvie. I... I believe you. Okay. Thanks. Come on. Let's put some miles between us in this place. It's just a little further. We're almost there. I sure hope that's a cook fire. Oh, we could use a hot meal right about now. Might be all I need. Come on. I'll race you to the top. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Come on, Alvy. We got this. You cheated. Holy shit. We did it, Clem. That's... That's gotta be it. I... <laughs> Looks like a big wall. What? Out here? In the middle of nowhere? No. That's gotta be it. What are we waiting for? Come on! This one's gonna be the one. Look at those walls. We'll finally feel safe, Clem. Be able to sleep at night. That's far enough. Just stay still, Clem. Do as she says. Put your hands up, Clem. Drop your weapons. Just a couple of people at the front gate. They don't look like trouble. Sounds good. Hi, I'm Edith. Name's Kenny. And this here's Clementine. Hello. Oh, what a handsome boy. Look at him. What's his name? Alvin. Junior. Oh, he's gonna be a little heartbreaker when he grows up. Is there someone named Krista in there? 
I don't think so, dear. So, this is Wellington, right? A lot of people call it that. Okay, so what do we do to get in? Well, I'm afraid this is the part where I give you the bad news. How's this? That's some supplies. Food, water, what? some medicine, a first aid kit. Why are kit. you giving us this? Unfortunately, our community isn't accepting new members. We're over capacity as it is, and there's just not enough to go around if we keep bringing people in. Things might change you in a few months. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I'm sorry. I really am. But, but we have a baby. This. This is hard for me, too. I don't want to turn anyone away, especially children, but... Just take the kids! What? Please, just take the kids! It's too dangerous out here for them. Kenny, it's I... It's just a little girl and a baby boy. You can make room for that. You can take back the supplies you gave us, if that helps. Please, just... I need them to be safe. And it's safe in there. I know that. Just ask someone, please. They won't make it out here. Please! Well... I'll ask. Just give me a second. You don't need to look at me like that. This is for the best. What the hell are you doing? Look at these walls. It's safe here. You two will be safe. That's what's important now. We can take the children, but just the children. I made the case that Thank you. Thank you. Listen, okay? Listen. This is your chance for you and this boy. I don't trust myself to keep you two safe. Not anymore. Please, I'm begging you. Please, stay here. Stay here where it's safe. Where you two will have a chance. No, no, no! Why are you doing this? Because it's the only way for both of you. Think about Alvy here. Please, Clem, just do as I'm asking. This one last time. You'll meet people. You'll make friends. People better than me. Good people. They, they don't have to look at you and feel ashamed at what they put you through. Okay. Okay, we'll stay. Good. We'll stay. Good. This is the right decision. Okay. Right. But when he's grown, you tell him about his mommy and his daddy and all the people who tried to keep him safe. You tell him, okay? He deserves to know. Uh, I got, uh... Oh, here. Here. Take this. He's old enough, you make him wear it. It'll, it'll keep the sun out of his eyes. That's important. All right. Good. Keep an eye out for him. Please. Now, you take care of Alvin here. You, you live a good life, okay? Waste this, okay? Now, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go before one of us. before one of us changes their mind. Now, I'm gonna walk away. I might not look back. Not because I don't want to. I'm real glad to have met you, Clementine. 